I'm Nur Atira and I'm studying at University Technology Mara. My supervisor is Dr. Khaira Nadim Ahmad Sekap and my Hello. colleague partner which is Ilani Hi. and Nur Azuria. Before I begin, I will show you some clip to show how many people knew about what is nanotechnology. Do you guys know what is nanotechnology? No. <laughs> Through the clip, most of them does not know what is nanotechnology. So, I will explain what is the meaning of nanotechnology. Okay, so here is a, the meaning of a what is nanotechnology. So, nanotechnology is the creation of a useful materials, devices, and system through control of a matter on the nanometer length scale and exploitation of a novel phenomena and properties at the length scale. It was commonly known in a nanofiber field, which you can see in the picture on your left side. Nanofiber can be defined as a fiber having a diameter less than a micron. It was a highly porous 3D structure and the fiber axis direction from micro scale to nano scale. It is easy for hand handling. As you can see here, there are various applications of nanofiber in different fields, and drug delivery is one of them, which I'm going to produce. Nanofiber is produced via electrospinning. So here is an electrospinning machine. It consists of, of voltage, shrink pump, shrink, and collector. This is PVA. It has a unique properties such as good chemical resistance, thermal stability, biocompatibility, and also non-toxicity, which it makes it suitable to be electrospun as polymer drug carrier. Now, this is aloe vera. Aloe vera is known as a therapeutic herb that exists a thousand years ago. This aloe vera is to treat burn, wound, and even to reduce the fever. Currently, aloe vera were commonly used as cream, liquid, and even capsule. So now, let's go to the lab to see how aloe vera will be formed in a membrane. The PVA powder will be added up with aloe vera powder and will be mixed by using magnetic stirrer. After mix them up, it will be produced by using electrospinning machine. This is how the PVA and aloe vera membrane were formed. After the membrane was done, it shows the overall result of the membrane. The image on the upper left side shows cylindrical, smooth and longitudinal shape of nanofiber, whereas the FDI art had concluded the appearance of aloe vera in PVA nanofiber. From the lower left side of the result, we can see the differential scanning telemetry shows the presence of alloy as the grass transition shifts from 81 degree to 76 degree. The last result shows the release of aloe vera, which are very promising membrane to act as a wound healing. When this kind of injury occurred as shown in this clip, Instead of using cream to treat the wound, it is more easy to patch the membrane on the skin. So, thank you for watching. Hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.